Hello children. Welcome to Happy Hippo Kids Academy. In today's video, we will be learning about animals and their habitats. So let's get started. Our nature has blessed us with many species of animals which makes the world more beautiful. Animals can be classified under many categories. Habitat is one of them. But before we begin, let us first understand what a habitat is. A habitat is a place where an animal makes its home. It provides the animal with an environment to survive with all its basic needs such as air, food, water and shelter. Let us now see how we can classify the animals on the basis of their habitats. Aerial Amphibian Aquatic Arboreal and Terrestrial let us now have a look at each of these. Amphibian Amphibians are animals who have gills in the early stage of their life cycle. As they grow up into adults, it develops into lungs. They need to keep their skin moist, so they prefer to stay near wet places like ponds, rivers or swamps. Some common examples are frogs and salamanders. Remember, crocodiles and snakes are reptiles and not amphibians. Although they stay near water bodies like swamps and marshes because they have dry scaly skin. Amphibians, on the other hand, have moist skin. Now let us have a look at the aerial animals. Birds make their nests on trees. So, are they aerial or arboreal animals? Let us now look at these points closely. Birds also belong to the animal kingdom. They build their nests on trees, but have wings to fly and spend their time mostly in the air. Hence, are aerial animals. Aquatic animals live in water bodies such as ponds, lakes, rivers and oceans. They breathe in oxygen dissolved in water through gills or skin. The most common example of aquatic animal can be fish. Coming to the arboreal animals. These animals spend most of their time on trees. They find their food and resting place on trees itself. Monkeys and rodents like squirrels are some common examples of arboreal animals. Terrestrial animals live on land. Some common examples of terrestrial animals are dogs, lions, camels. Terrestrial habitats include forests, deserts and plains. Remember, we humans are terrestrial animals as well. Let's have a quick recap now. Animals can be classified under the places where they dwell, which is commonly called a habitat. It is a place where an animal makes its home and it provides the animal with an environment to survive with all the basic needs. It can be aerial, amphibian, aquatic, arboreal, and terrestrial. Aerial animals love to live in the air, whereas amphibians prefer 
to stay on land and in water. Aquatic animals live in water. Arboreal animals prefer to live on trees and terrestrial animals live on various landforms which include deserts, plains, wetlands, grasslands and many more. Point to ponder. Remember, kennels, sheds, barns or other shelters of animals are either man-made or natural, like caves and dens. They are different from a habitat, as a habitat is the complete environment in which an animal can survive with all its basic needs. Remember, habitat is a natural place, whereas shelters can be man-made or natural at the same time. And now it's time for an activity. Draw a scenery with clear blue sky, trees and ponds. Color it neatly. If you wish, you can collect a picture of the same. Paste different types of animals according to their habitats on your scenery. Thank you for watching. Please like, share and subscribe too. Bye-bye.